Well, the foreign minister has been in Jakarta pushing the case for a refugee processing centre in East Timor. But despite, despite Stephen Smith's best efforts, the Indonesians are still not convinced it's a good move. They say that while the idea has potential, there needs to be a lot more consultation. The ABC's Kerry Ritchie reports from Jakarta. A little bit of hope in a poor part of Indonesia. Stephen Smith opened the 2000th Indonesian school paid for by Australia, an hour's drive outside Jakarta. So we've got separate, a doctor, an astronaut, a police officer, an architect. Yes. That's good. The foreign minister is also here to educate Indonesia about the government's new asylum seeker policy. Australia's bid to build a refugee processing centre in East Timor is making big news here. The Indonesian government is worried thousands of asylum seekers will cross from East Timor into Indonesia's West Timor. And I can understand uh, the rationale behind them and uh, I'm sure in the, in the days and weeks to come as we further delve into it, we will have a better appreciation of what uh, the whole concept is all about. Stephen Smith says the government is still firmly focused on East Timor and there will be more meetings in coming weeks. I think we're both now of the view that given this proposal uh, and the need to discuss it throughout the region, we should do that sooner rather than later. While Indonesia didn't criticise the idea, it did not endorse the proposal for a refugee processing centre in East Timor. Stephen Smith has described his visit as productive, but some in Indonesia are asking why the foreign minister came here instead of East Timor. Kerry Ritchie, Lateline.